Hello, that college football guy here with another video. Um, this is a story I'm reporting about that happened on Wednesday. I haven't really heard much nationally about it. And I just broke on it because it was just recently updated. Um, about Jaden Rashada, a five-star QB prospect from Southern California, who had originally committed to Miami but flipped to the University of Florida, has asked for notified Florida to release him from his national letter of intent because a promise wasn't made regarding NIL. But first, let's get this out the way real quick. Everyone, please smash that like button, hit the thumbs up. It helps with the algorithm, helps with the analytics, helps the video to be seen by more people. Comment on the video. I want to hear what you think about this. If this is financially motivated, because I see, I think it is, but you tell me after I tell you everything. And subscribe to the channel. On our way to 300 subscribers, let's see if we can get there. Okay. This is per report from 24-7 Sports. Um, Jaden... Rashada, the five-star QB prospect, has reportedly asked Florida for relief, release him for his national letter of intent. Rashada had flipped from Miami to Florida in November, but is now part of the Florida program. Rashada reportedly, you know, I reportedly, I rumor. That's why I'm going this. That's why it's rumor in the title because until I hear words from him, turned down millions of dollars from Miami in order to go to to Florida. His family. Uh, the report went out the fact that financial reasons were for the national letter of intent for him being released. His father came out and said, no, that's not the case. I think otherwise, because the report came from the Orlando Sentinel, it says that Rashada has not enrolled at Florida yet because a, this is the Orlando Sentinel's quote, NIL agreement for around $13 million was not honored, end quote. You want me to come here you would offer me $13 million. I flipped from Miami to Florida. I signed my letter of intent. I'm ready to enroll, and you said I'm not getting the money. Does this sound like Texas A&M to you? Has that vibe to me? Um, Shada could be possibly working to sever ties in Florida, and he has reportedly returned home to Southern California instead of enrolling in school. Let's have a name of chicken going on here, folks. Um... This is what happened at Texas A&M, correct me if I'm wrong. They promised kids promised kids this NIL money, and all of a sudden, no, we're not doing it. To get them to sign, smoke and mirrors. And with the new transfer things, try to trap them to stay. This isn't become a problem. So um, I'm interested to see how this is going to go. This is going to be potentially an issue for the NCAA. We're faulting on an NIL agreement. Let me allow the student to not enroll in school. Because I don't know once you sign letter of intent, do you have to enroll? Do you not have to enroll? Is there a requirement for that? Let me know down in the comments about that because I'm not quite I'm not quite sure about that. But this could be something for the future that could be happening a lot more. Thanks everybody for watching the video. Hope everybody has a great Saturday. You know, I'm not ready to run some errands here and we'll see what else pops off in college football. So thanks everybody. Have a great day and please be good to each other.